everybody, it's Heather, and welcome to Mystic Musings. I had planned to do uh, another vlog today and just got totally behind, uh, so we're going to put this together and I will see you face-to-face -face next week probably, but anyway. So today for Spooky Sunday, <laughs> this is just, it, oh god, um, La Pascualita. This is happening in Chihuahua, Mexico. There's a bridal shop there known as La Popular, and there's this mannequin there that's wearing a wedding dress in the store window, which makes sense because it's a bridal shop, you know, that's totally normal, not spooky at all. Um, but the problem is that she's not so much a mannequin as a corpse. Yeah. So for 75 years, the bridal shop has had a lot of rumors going around uh, about this mannequin because a lot of people think that it is the owner's daughter. Uh, she had passed away tragically on her wedding day from a black widow spider bite. So this mannequin was placed in the window on March 25th, 1930. And I mean, right away, people noticed what you're all probably noticing now, which is that there's nothing plastic or fake looking about her. Uh, in fact, it's it's really quite disturbing how real she looks. It looks like at any moment, you know, she's just gonna turn her eyes and look at you. Um, obviously, the the owner Pasquala Esbraza says, you know, no, 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 this is not my daughter. You know, no big thing. Um, but what's a little bit kind of suspicious is that there are only like two employees in the store that are allowed to change her clothes and it has to happen behind a closed door you know it's it's not at all uncommon to walk by a storefront and see people you know changing the mannequins outfits and stuff if you go shopping um, but not here here no it, it's all behind you know under lock and key so that's um, a little bit weird and if you look at her hands, I mean, they're so incredibly realistic. Not only are there wrinkles, um, but I mean, you know, you can look at her fingernails. I mean, they look completely human. Um, and apparently, I, don't, I couldn't find any photos, but you can even see the varicose veins on her legs. So other employees have said that they come into the shop sometimes in the morning to see that she's kind of changed positions on her own. And then other employees say that they feel like she's watching them during the day. So I definitely, personally, from just looking at this, looking at the pictures, looking at the stories, uh, I don't think that she's alive. Uh, and I don't necessarily think that she's, you know, a, a ghost. But I, I do think that she really is this corpse. And it's not actually uncommon for some corpses to be so perfectly preserved. There are stories, especially about saints, uh, that were, you know, buried in, in hundreds of years ago, and they still look fantastic today. I mean, it looks like they're resting. So, you know, it is it is possible um, scientifically for her to look like this. But you know, you have to wonder if it is true. And I gotta say, I'm I'm kind of buying into it. You know, how come, how come no one has said for sure yet? You know, like the employees, like the ones that dress her. I mean, it's a bridal shop. Are they making such good money that they're not going to tell people like, yeah, this is, this is a dead body. Like, I don't know. So that there's a couple things about it that to me, uh, maybe are a little bit hard to buy into, hard to understand, but definitely, definitely, um, I mean, I, I think she looks just disturbingly, <laughs> disturbingly real. So, I mean, what do you guys think? Do, you know, you're looking at the pictures, you're, you're seeing what I'm seeing. I mean, do you think that she's just a very realistic dummy? Do you, I mean, I, I don't know. You know, she was put there in the 1930s. I mean, are there other mannequins produced in that time that look like this? I mean, and to me, if you look at her face even, it looks like she has almost like really heavy makeup on. You can kind of see that powder line below her hairline. Um, so, you know, there's there's a lot, there's a lot definitely to look at. There's a lot to 
consider, and, and certainly there's two sides to every story, so I want to hear what you think. So let me know in the comments if you think that this is a, a dead body, if you think that it's just a really crazy rumor. Um, you know, I, I want to hear what you guys have to say. So anyway, again, I know this was a really quick video. I know Friday was quick too, but um, I just wanted to cover both of those stories, the one from Friday and the one from today. Uh, and I'm trying to get some really great stuff together for October, and all those videos are going to be, you know, kind of a bit longer. So this is just sort of to to get us to that point. But anyway, uh, thank you all so much for listening, uh, for looking, uh, and I will see you all on Freaky Friday. I hope the rest of your weekend is fantastic. Thanks, guys. Bye.